billion tons of plastic and landfills around the world. Eight million tons land in oceans every single year. Even in the European Union, with the strictest regulations, less than 32% of plastic is recycled. Why is that? It's because there are very few effective and profitable technologies to convert end-of-life plastics. I'm Susan Kim Homitska. I'm the CEO and co-founder of Handerik Technologies. We're fueling the circular economy by recycling waste plastic into diesel and gasoline fractions. So plastics are made of oil. Our installations convert that plastic back into oil, and even better yet, to fully refined EU normative diesel and gasoline fractions. It's a highly effective process, converting one kilogram of, waste, uh, of plastic waste into one liter of fuel. So waste management companies right now, what they do is they collect the municipal waste, they sort it, and then they sell off what can be recycled. Metals, glass, pet plastic bottles, but the rest of the materials, they have to pay to dispose of it, either in landfilling or in incineration, or even exporting it to other countries. So in Poland, we are paying a minimum of 35 euros per ton to dispose of it. In, Brit in Great Britain, it's even much higher. It's 50 to 80 uh, British pounds. Uh, and so by adopting our technology, you can convert what is an expense into a highly profitable revenue source. You could generate a thousand, almost a thousand euro per ton. And as such, the return on investment for, those, for our customers can be between two and three years. In Europe, seven, over seven million tons were landfilled uh, in 2016. That's an annual production number. So that would allow for over 500 installations of a 10,000 ton capacity. This could generate 5 billion euros in additional revenue for waste management companies. Of course, this is not a European problem. This is a global problem. And as such, it's a global opportunity. We are a B2B, B2G technology provider. Our customers are waste management companies, municipalities, manufacturers with plastic waste, and recycling companies. We plan to charge a 3% licensing royalty fee and sell our patented plastic to fuel installations. So our goal in five years is to have installed 290,000 tons of capacity, which would generate 132 million euros in revenue cumulatively. We already have two letters of interest from uh, an intentions uh, with two waste management companies in Poland, and we have interest from abroad. At this point, we are getting calls weekly. We are the most cost-effective method of recycling plastic and waste uh, in producing the highest quality of fuel. And we do this at half the, uh, not only are we better in terms of all of our parameters and quality of fuel, uh, we produce at half the cost, uh, both in capex and operating cost. We are a team. Uh, Adam Handerik is my co-founder and CTO. He's the visionary behind the technology, dedicating over 10 years of experience of research and development and eight generations of pilot to get to this point. I'm a serial entrepreneur with global experience, and together we founded the company to take the uh, technology to market. We're also supported by Scientific Council, who are the top minds in chemical processes, uh, industrial man and machinery, and environmental protection. And our technology was fully tested by the Automotive Institute, both for fuel for, and process and gases and everything. And we came out with flying colors. And last year, at every major innovation and technology fair, including Enea, which is the largest in Europe, we won the grand prize in recognition of the innovativeness of our technology. So we've uh, done our research. We uh, had a successful pilot. We were patent awarded last year, and we filed for a PCT. We're patent pending in major markets. We have also filed, uh, filed another patent as well. And we are raising 500,000 euro to build our 300-ton engineering pilot, which we plan to finish the fourth quarter of this year. We've already started the de design. and should be finished the end of this month and go to market next year. So if you want to be part of a, a team that will become the global standard in plastic to waste, plastic to fuel market, and to help significantly make a significant impact on the environment, please come talk to me.